What's the story? Morning glory. The question I asked myself when I was looking at this engine, which is the one, the better one that came with the parts bike, it wouldn't turn over. A quick look saw that the head was actually quite okay. The only thing that's happened is because if I'm looking there, will it show you? No, no, it won't. The inlet valve was sitting up with the manifold off that it rusted out inside there the exhaust valve is fine but the spark plug was left out which is a problem so I bit the bullet and pulled the head and that's what I found so water's got into the bore but the piston was three quarters of the way up and I just gave it a tap with the handle of a hammer and down she went. So the bottom end it looks like it's going to be okay. I had to play with the transfer, the um, high-low transfer. It wasn't working. Turns out that one of the dowels that guides it in had dropped out. Someone's been in the plane, obviously. And uh, was jamming it up. Now, what's the charm? Nothing to it. And all the bottom end that's coming out is into oil. It seems to turn over okay, so I'm just going to clean that bore, put it back together, and see what happens. And uh, I'll have a play from there. I doubt it's going to run. Like, I mean, let's face it, we've only got parts. But worst case is, like, you can buy brand new pistons, bores, everything for these things. The head looks okay. The valve may come back. I may have to pull it, depending on what we do. So I'll give that a bit of a clean up with the wire wheel. See what we can do with that and um, play from there. I was using a bit of a uh, transmission oil, so I fucking got that shit everywhere. And uh, boilie, I don't know if you've got one of these, but these are a fantastic tool. So it basically, you hit it at the end, the screwdriver, and it turns it as you're pushing in. So it gets those screws out without gouging the fuck out of them. So a nice little trick. All right, that's today. Adios.